Hello class! Welcome to today's math lesson. Today we are looking at what is a pair. And I know that at the end of today's lesson you are going to be able to say I can identify and count pairs. Well the first question we can ask ourselves is what is a pair? Not that kind of pair. We are not talking about the fruit today. A pair is a set of two things that are used together, like sneakers. What are some items that come in pairs? I want you to think about it. Hmm. Some hints would be things that go on our feet or things that go on our hands. Can you think of some pairs? What about sneakers? They come in pairs. Or mittens? Boots come in pairs. So do boxing gloves. Skates come in pairs. And so do gloves and cozy socks. Even skis come in pairs. There are so many items which come in pairs. That means there are two items that you use together. Like you would use two skates, not just one. Here we have some boxing gloves. And I have a question. How many pairs of boxing gloves do you see? Well, let's count them. There's one. One pair of boxing gloves. Hmm, but I have another question. How many gloves are there? Let's count them together. One, two. There are two gloves. Now there's only one pair, but there's two gloves because a pair is two items that are used together. Here I have some pairs of socks. How many pairs are there? Count them with me. One, two, three, four. There are four pairs of socks. Hmm, how many socks are there? There's not four socks. So when we count our socks, we're gonna have to count them by two because there's two in a pair. Count with me. Two, four, six, eight. How many socks are there? Eight socks. Well done. Here are some cozy mittens. How many pairs of mittens are there? Count them with me. One, two, three, four, and Five. There are five pairs of mittens. Hmm. How many mittens would there be? More than five. Because each pair has two mittens. And when we count our pairs, we're going to count them by two to see how many mittens there are. Count with me. Two, four, six, eight, and Ten! How many mittens? Ten mittens. If we have five pairs, there would be ten items. Here I have some boots. How many pairs? Count with me. One, two, three. There are three pairs of boots. But how many boots are there? Two, Four, six. There are six boots. Here I have some earrings. How many pairs of earrings are there? One, two. That's right, there are two pairs. Hmm. But if we have two pairs, how many earrings are there? There would be two, four. We always count by two when we're counting the individual earrings. How many earrings? Four. 
what other items come in a pair that don't really go on your feet or your hands? What about a pair of crutches? Knitting needles? Can you think of something else? What about chopsticks? Or dice? Or symbols? Drumsticks also come in pairs. Oh, look at our skateboarder. He has, he's wearing a lot of pairs. Can you see what they are? He has a pair of elbow pads and a pair of knee pads. But that's not all. He's also wearing a pair of socks and a pair of shoes. There are even two pairs of wheels on his skateboard. Class, I am so glad that you reviewed identifying and counting pairs with me today. And I know that you're going to be able to say, I can identify and count pairs. I'm sure that you'll remember that a pair is a set of two things that are used together. Two items make one pair. Thank you so much for learning with me today. I hope that you have a wonderful day class. Bye-bye.